welcome back to the White Stoner channel here on YouTube. So today I'm back with the PS2 game haul. Um, got quite a bit. There's a few in here I've never played before. So I'll let you know which ones I haven't played and which ones I have played. So there's no order. There's two bags. So let's see what I got. First up, let me take off the price tag. It'll let me. Alright, it's not letting me at the moment. But the first game I got is Final Fantasy X. Um, I was playing this on PS, the PS4 version. But I said, you know what? I want to get it on PS2 and relive the good old days. So, this is rated T, obviously. And if you can believe it... This game is only 64 gigabytes, and it is supposed to be one of the longest PS2 games out there. Um, I am actually farther in it on the PS4 version, so hopefully we can just, you know, get the data and then re-download the game. But um, I'm not looking forward to what I have to redo in this game, but I know what to do now, and I'm excited to um, do it better this time I guess is a way to say it so that's the disc art and I got robbed I didn't get a booklet next up okay I got Tiger Woods PGA Tour 07 so I played the PS3 version of this game and I actually beat that version of it. So I became a, a pro golfer or whatever it is. And then I beat Tiger Woods. So I'm pretty excited to see how the PS2 version is. And um, nothing too fancy. Just a just your old fashioned golf game. But uh, the PG or the Tiger Woods PJ Tour games were a lot better than the ones today. I haven't tried the newest one for PS5 yet, though. But um, real excited about this one. I do remember this PS2 game here. Next up, of course, I got Final Fantasy X. So, what are you thinking? Of course, Final Fantasy X 2 right here. I had to get it. It's a pair. Um, and once again, I got ripped off. But um, seeing that disc art, once again, is so cool. I haven't seen that disc art in a long time. But check that out. Next up is Tiger Woods PG Tour 05. This is the one I was playing until I decided to take my old PS2 back because it wasn't working right. And then I finally upgraded to the slim model. We all know that one's better than the fat boy. So this is the one I was playing. I'm glad to have it back. So I didn't play it back in the day when I said I was playing it. I mean I was literally playing it like um, last year. So. Next up, uh, this one I'm pretty excited for. I did play it back in the day. I'm ready to play it again. Um, I can't believe it was still there to be honest. That is Madagascar. Um, I had no idea what I was doing because if I can get this sticker off, I can tell you tell you what year it came out.
So I believe it came out in 2005, or around the same time the movie came out. That would only make sense. But, um, yes, Madagascar came completed. It is a blue disc. So. Uh, yeah, this, this game was awesome. I had a lot of fun with it. And then this game, can't believe I got it. Um, let me get some of this stuff off of it. Let's see if I can. It's stuck into my finger here. a little better uh, next game is Rocky uh, I am very excited to play this one I played it on my cousin's PS2 when I was uh, younger and it was um, a very cool game then and I can't believe I have it now so this is my first time owning it and whatnot but super excited to, to play some Rocky And then finally, in that bag, can't go wrong with Sly 2, Bane of Thieves. Um, this is my favorite one of all three of them. Um, I would like to try number three more, because I thought that one was cool from what I tried. Uh, number one I tried, but um, maybe I was too pussy and didn't give it much of a chance. Um... But I wouldn't mind trying the first one out again. But um, this is this was the one I always played. It was number two. Um, of course, I got ripped off. No manual. But um, that was from that bag. And then let's see what's in this bag. Uh, next up is Cabela's Big Game Hunter 2005 Adventures. Um, I wasn't the one to get much of the hunting games until PS3 came out. Um, it was around 2015 I got the Cabela's Hunt Wild Africa or something for for it. And let me tell you something, that game sucked balls. I will say that right now. I felt like it was, too, it was a little too easy and um, I just felt like I beat it too quickly. So, if you ever played that one, you might know which one I'm talking about. It, it sucked ball. So, uh, hopefully this one is a lot better. I'm going to hope it is. Guarantee it is because it's a Cabela's game. And you can't never go wrong with Cabela's big hunting games. So, um, I'm going to try and collect all the Cabela's games because that would be super cool. Next up, um, the only game I've ever played on PS2, Xbox 360, and PC is Cars. So this is the only one that I noticed that had pretty much a lot of scratches on it. But um, we'll see if it works. If it doesn't, that's only one. That's not a... One, one game out of everything I got today, so that's not too bad. But um, if you remember this game, let me know in the comments. This was a, a fun game. And then the last game is one I've never played. Um, this is the one I've seen pretty, pretty much in any, everyone's collection. Everybody had this game back in the day, except me. And this is Tony Hawk's Project 8. Um, never played it. Can't wait to check it out. Um, I'm sure the, the pro skaters are better, right? Don't know. Didn't play those either, so. Um, but I think I remember... I think I remember the trailer 
uh, for this game though, because this game came out in 2006. So, so there you have it. There's all the games I got, and then of course, can't go wrong with a second memory card, right here, baby. So I finally have two memory cards. You can't ever have enough of these when it comes to PS2 games. So, so there you have it. There's everything I got today. Um, let me know in the comments down below which one your favorite game was or if you have any recommendations for me to play I will um, Try and find it and then I will definitely give you a shout out and tag you in the video since YouTube does that now so um, Yeah, you know what to do don't forget to subscribe don't forget to leave a like on this video, and once again, let me know what your favorite PS2 game was, which one you liked out of the ones I got, and your host, Whitestoner, is out.